Hey, what's up guys? It's Twigs here, bringing you another story time with Twigs, and by requests, I will keep these as IRL stories, and maybe a few Xbox stories here and there, but mainly IRL stories. And before I get into this, um, I just want to let you guys know that if you couldn't tell by my YouTube title, I am the new co-leader of Liked, so if you guys want to join, there's an RC out, I'll put it in the description, and please do not spam me if you have me on, if you have me on Skype, please do not spam me about joining, I will not reply to you if you are spamming me and it's really annoying and it's not gonna help you get in so yeah um uh and also to begin this story um i'm not it's all true but i'm not i'm gonna keep it like kind of less detailed because it just offends some people so i'm gonna keep it kind of basic so yeah um here we go um it was about seventh or eighth grade um it was back when black ops 1 first came out and this is kind of back when i first started sniping and me and my friend mark were just kind of talking we we're talking about sniping i asked him a question i said hey what was your favorite uh what was your best or favorite clip that you ever hit and he said that that was like a triple a triple collateral on uh on uh nuketown and i was and that was like pretty good back then so i was like whoa and then I didn't have anything to match it up, and then we somehow drone on just started coming up with a story about quick scoping people. Like, uh, I don't know, I started writing it on like a piece of notebook paper. And yeah, um, for some reason we thought that the story was like really, really good, so we wanted to get it published. So we kept the story for a while, but before we kept it, um, my brother wanted to read it, so we gave it to him, and he read it the next class period, but. As stupid as he is, he read it during class, so the substitute teacher that was filling in for the teacher that day um, picked it up, she read it, she kept it, and she just happened to be my English teacher also, so she knew who I was, and even, like, it also had my name on it, and my friend Mark's name on it, so they kind of knew already who it was, and I got sent down to the principal's office the next day, um, started questioning me about it, and then Mark showed up, and then they take me out of the room, and then Mark came out of the room, and then we came up with a story about, um, just, like, that Mark got bullied at school, and that the only reason we're making it, because that was what the bullies were saying to him, like, it was just some, like, bullshit story that we just came up with in, like, five, in, like, fish, like, 50 seconds, like, in a minute, and then... We just kind of stuck to that story. We never changed it, and that actually got us away with it because, it, um, to begin with, she thought that it was like we were threatening to kill people by quick scoping them at the school, which is stupid. Like, we don't have any guns. We would never do that. Like, it's kind of common sense. Like, no, no seventh grade boys or eighth grade boys are gonna bring snipers to a school and start quick scoping people like that's just stupid and we didn't want to stick we didn't want to say that was just because like we play a video game instead of video game because then they would like tell our parents and we would like the parents would make us stop playing video games because we like play them too much or whatever so we didn't use that we just kept it as you know that is mark getting bullied even though it wasn't true and we didn't get off all the way like we still got some punishment we got ISS for a day and for people that don't know what ISS is it's um it stands for in school suspicion suspension it's like detention sort of except it's during school not after school like it's for the whole day and yeah we got that for just a day like it's fine you don't do anything there you just kind of sit you just kind of sit there and sleep for the whole day so I guess it was fine so that was we got off of that if we didn't stick with that story and we said it was about just a video game, I would probably not doing be doing this YouTube stuff and I would maybe be in special programs because they said that they were going to send us to special programs. Um, if, like, they said they were going to send us to special programs if my mom didn't show up. My mom showed up and she kind of convinced them that we weren't going to do anything bad, we're not bad kids, you know. So my mom kind of saved us there too, but we still got some punishment, but that's fine, it's all over with, that was back 7th grade, you know, it was just a little funny experience that happened, 
as little kids. So, I don't know, I guess that's it. Um, we still got a lot of gameplay here, so I guess I'll just, like, do a little bit of updates for you guys. Um, as I said, I was, I'm co-leader of Liked right now. Um, we are an invite-only team. We have about 42,000 subscribers right now. And, um, just, yeah, just kind of saying, if you guys want to join, there's an RC, like I said, um, and it's invite only, so don't start, like, slinking me clips on Skype, like, I'm probably not going to look at them unless I kind of, like, know who you are, and no offense, like, if I know that you're bad, I'm probably not going to watch it, because there'd be no point, and just, yeah, I mean, yeah, <laughs> but... Um, some other stuff, I guess. Um, I'm gonna try to be more active. Start uploading some more. I know I've already said that. I made a video saying I was gonna be more active. and But I know I haven't really stick to that. Uh, I don't know. I just haven't done anything really recently. Like, I've just been hanging out with friends. And I ran out of Xbox Live. So I've just been having to get two days off people. For the past, like, week. So I'm being kind of lazy with uploads, but I'm going to try to fix that really soon, and hopefully I'll be back when I get live Friendly again. Hunter killer drone deploy. And yeah, um, it's kind of mostly about it, guys, and I guess this wraps it up. Good job, it's been Twigs squad. here, and Stand peace.